Here's how you can use Printify with Amazon so you can easily integrate Amazon with Printify by doing the simple stuff that I'm going to show you in this video. So make sure you watch this video till the end to understand the step by step if you skip the, any part so you won't know what to do. So there is no official integration for both of these platforms. So as you all know that Printify can be connected with Amazon or either Amazon can be linked to Printify. So I don't know why but there is only one method that you can do and no one knows about this like literally this is the only video that you will find out how you can connect a Printify to Amazon. So yeah make sure you watch this video till the end to understand everything. So first of all you have to log in or sign up your Printify account. So let's just make our Printify account. I'm just gonna sign up because I'm new to Printify. Alright continue with Google. Hold on, hold on. Uh, let me open this on new tab. So, um, let's go to Printify. So, yeah, here we are. Just gonna log in, um, sign up. Here's Google. This account confirm. And we wait. There we go. No, it's gonna ask us a few questions when you log in into Printify. So what describes you best? Uh, I have my own e-commerce store. I mean, yeah, I'm or other. You can just you can. I'm just gonna press random stuff over here. Also, it's asking me to connect your Printify store. So, when I'm here, so as all can see. There is no Amazon. I cannot connect it to wh whatever I do. There is Etsy, there is Shopify, there is TikTok. But there is no Amazon. So how do you connect it? So let's just go to Amazon. Amazon seller. And make your Amazon account. So making an Amazon account is very easy. But as you all know, I don't have Amazon in my country. But you have to put your email and phone number over here. And when you do this... It will just simply just uh, make your account. Let me try if I can make one. My email. Let's put something, some line, my password. There we go. Just have to solve this puzzle. Let me solve this puzzle. There we go. Submit. All right. Okay, he's gonna ask for the OTP. All right. That's. Yes. Yeah. the There we go. Now we just put it here. Verify. And now it's gonna ask for my number, and it. It sadly I don't have a number for Amazon, and I can't use it right over here. So that's the problem right now. So as you all can see, it doesn't support my country, but. Already verify and make your Amazon account just go and um so let me cl let me clear a few things so yes you can you can like uh, you put to like Printify and Amazon together for FBA but for like for faster uh, fulfillment and secure stock but um Amazon will like uh many you connected like to Amazon like Amazon will fully handle customer service and return management for your FBA orders so yeah. But even though there is no native integration for Amazon, as I told you all earlier, that with Printify, you can sell POD products created with um, Printify by using um, by using other Printify integrations or third-party solutions. So I have a third-party solutions with, with, which I'm going to show you later in this video. So make sure you stick this in this video till the end. So yeah, and Printify needs a GTIN ex uh, extension. Get yours with, with um, Printify support team. So how do we get it? So first of all, we go to help and help center. So we want a GTIN. So it could take a few da days if you ask him, uh, ask uh, Printify. So as all can see, when you get your GD, GTIN, so um, 
it will just gives you it will gives you or uh, it will give you the options to connect to like um other like apps. So as you all can see, one to compare sales channels and uh, compare integrations. So I'm really shocked that I don't have like um no like Amazon over here because Amazon is a very huge company. But when you get your GTIN, just um go back to Amazon and Amazon seller account and make sure that your uh, seller account is um verified and everything because the that process can take up to like um let's say uh two to three days from uh, verifying your account and both. So we yeah, when you're finishing you're doing all of these steps, so I'm gonna tell you the secret that no one knows. So the secret is this website on Lizer. So literally no one knows about this and no one is talking about this on uh, for on internet. So as you all can see, it gives you a 30 days free trial trial, no credit card required, test any feature. So let's check out the pricing first. So um you got basic for nineteen dollars a month and standard, I think the standards is the best if you want if you like use like um integrations and you get you get unlimited integrations on basic too, but like you get more like recurrent tasks and basic support, uh like a lot more in standard. But yeah, if you only want um, ba um uh, integrations, you can just go for simple basic nineteen dollars a month. But yeah, after that, you can just um go back. And as all can see. Looking for Amazon and Printify integration service using Onlizer, you can connect Amazon with Printify setup notifications about events or enable communication in chats, automate data sync, data analyze, and uh, and BL tools. Learn how to design, build, automate anything for your work by integrating services like ClickUp and Google Forms to create visual automated apps. So as all can see, it's telling us that connect Amazon plus Printify with no code uh, integration in a few clicks. So it's very easy. So first of all, let's check integration options. So as you all can see, it's telling us create customized individual integrations of Amazon to Printify with no flexible, easy to use, no codes needed. So as you all can see, if you want to read, if you're interested, you can read all these. But Amazon to Printify integration idea. So first of all, you can just request the Amazon to uh, Printify integration to other people. Like you, you can just um, log in and request and uh, people will do it, people will do it for you as well can see amazon and printify integration as well can see their requests but if you want to do it on your own as i told you all earlier you have to get the basic plan after you get your basic plan just uh, integrate amazon plus printify now click on it once you get your plan all right so as you all can see it's telling me to sign in i'm just gonna sign in i'm already register. i don't have an account Wait up. There we go. Let me put in um my email. There we go, no password. Just gonna click on the on the strong password. Because we won't use the account we won't use this account anyway. Alright. So there we have it. So once you have like um your uh, bonus plan, basic plan, just select the service. Uh, I'm gonna search a Printify. There we have it, Printify. Now Amazon. There we go. Now, as all can see, I don't have the b b plan, and it's telling me to add service for plans. So when when I click on add service, so as all can see, it brings me to this request page. So once you have uh, that uh, basic plan. It will give you this option on start. Just press on start and it will start integrating. But make sure that both of your accounts are logged in. Printify and Amazon, both of them are logged in. After that, just uh, make sure that both of your accounts are logged in and press start. And it will start integrating. You don't need any type of codes. You don't need to copy any type of codes. Just, copy, just press start and it will do its work. So yeah, that, that's it uh, on how you can uh, use Printify uh, to Amazon. So yeah, that's basically it. So yeah, guys, I, I hope I helped you guys out. Make sure you like this video. If you found this video helpful and subscribe to my channel and peace out.